I'm talking about today is pre-algebra unit two lesson six, simplified algebraic expression take two. The whole work that goes along with this is two to zero. Let's review the distributive property. So two times quantity three x plus one. I'm going to distribute the 2. 2 times 3x is 6x. Positive 2 times negative 1 is minus 2, so negative 2. 6x minus 3. This one, I'm distributing a negative 2 to the quantity x plus 3. Negative 2 times x is negative 2x. Negative 2 times positive 3 is negative 6. So 2x minus 3. Now, this is combining my terms. Sometimes I'll have distributed raw freedom. This one is just plain old combining like terms. So, what are the like terms? 2x plus 8x. 2x plus 8x is 10x. Positive 2 minus 5 is minus 3. Negative 3. So 10x minus 3. That's all I can do. Okay, simplify this expression. Combine the like terms. Negative 3x plus 6x, plus 10x. So I would add 6x and 10x and get 16x, minus 3x is 13x. 4 minus 9 will be negative 5. You're thinking 4 minus 9. Add the opposite, that's 4 plus negative 9, negative 5. So 13x minus 5. 5a plus a, remember there's a 1 here. 5 apple plus 1 apple is 6 apple. Alright, now, these get a little bit more complicated. You have some distributive property in here, and then combine my terms. Why do you have to distribute first? Well, let's think about this. Please excuse my dear Aunt Alice. We take care of exponents first, but inside the exponents, I can't do anything. Or, I'm sorry, you take care of parentheses first, but inside the parentheses, you can't do anything. There's no exponents. My dear says you multiply and divide before you add and subtract. Well, isn't the distributive property multiplying? <laughs> so this first quantity, I can't do anything to. I'm just going to write it down here. 5b plus 8t. Positive 2 times b is positive 2b. Make sure you write the plus. Plus 2b. Positive 2 times negative 3t is negative 6t. Now, I'm out of combining like terms. What like terms do I have? 5b plus 2b is 7b. 8t minus 6t is positive 2t. That's it. You can't combine those because they're not like terms. All right, this problem. Again, I need to use the distributive property before I combine like terms. So bring down this 8t. Negative 3 times c is negative 3t. Negative 3 times positive 5 is negative 15. Now I can combine like terms. 8c minus 3c is 5c. Bring down the minus 15 because I don't have anything to add to that. And I'm done. Alright, we have to distribute before we combine like terms. So I'm going to distribute a negative 9 here and a positive 6 here. So, negative 9 times 6m is negative 54m. Negative 9 times negative 3 is positive 27. Now I'm distributing the 6. 6 times 1 is positive 6. Make sure you write plus 6 because it's in a whole line so it can be combined. Positive 6 times positive 4m is positive 24m. Now, combine our like terms. Negative 54m plus 24m is negative 30m. Positive 27 plus 6 is positive 33. And I'm done because I can't combine anything else. Okay, this one. I'm going to distribute a 5 to the first quantity and a 2 to the second quantity. 5 times negative 2n is negative 10n. Positive 5 times positive 4 is positive 20. Positive 2 times n is positive 2n. Again, make sure you put the plus. Positive 2 times positive 3 is positive 6. Now I combine like terms. Negative 10n plus 2n is negative 8n. Positive 20 plus 6 is positive 26. 